I am back at another theme park, baby. Animal Kingdom. God, it's been a long time since I've been here. I don't even remember the last time. I'm pretty sure you guys do. I, I typically don't remember. But hey, Mike is here. I'm here. World of Micah, and it's a hot one, boys. It's hot. Oh, it is bad. And there's not a cloud in the sky, which means that I didn't have an umbrella. And there's no clouds. That's a 100% chance of rain. Because that's how it happens, it happens for me. <laughs> Coming to these parks. We come over here to Expedition Everest, and there is a crowd of people not getting on the ride. Why? What's going on? Corey, why'd you let the Yeti use? Why is he gone? Why'd you guys let him loose? Dude, yeah. you dropped the ball, bro. <laughs> you dropped the ball. Listen, listen, the Yeti wasn't supposed to leave. But who let the, the Yeti loose? I'm trying to figure out, was it you? Was it you? <laughs> Good old Harambe Market. We never forget you. Rest in peace. Always in our memories. We were just talking just a minute ago about the poaching. I guess this was a piece on the ride because it's everywhere. They just keep bringing up poaching and there's this sign. Although I can't think of anything more grim and depressing than the idea of poachers being on this ride, but it happened. I know this because Micah told me. Hey, it's Yokopi Johnson. Let's head over here towards the Black Rhino. World's greatest detective. We, saw the bones. we made a good this time to come into this ride because so cool. everything trail. is out. The rhinos are out. 3,000 pounds fully grown. Take a look at that. The sediment and color coat of the bone goes. There we are. And typically they're in the cave already, but hey, they're kind of out just laying Your around. Your homework is to look up. Male giraffe fully grown 20 feet tall, female giraffe fully grown 18 feet tall. The gestation period for a giraffe, 18 months. Yeah, that's twice that amount of time to fly. Brush there. Just to cool off. It's an elephant. They veins and arteries the yeah, they're they're quite them. active today. Flap on their bitty prehensile lip, which we didn't see. I nominate well, this guy for tour guide of the, of the year. The white rhino, however, have a larger head, and their heads hang lower on their bodies. If you're not sure about the distinction between the black and white rhino, <laughs> just look up on the spotted guide above you. There they are, side by side. Look the horn are small, again made of keratin. Oh, it's the same material as your fingernails in here. here. These are not like... Look at that. And there's the ostrich. It's all zebra. The group of zebra called it Goodbye, rhino. Hey, if you enjoyed your safari today, my name is Mike and this was Simbo One. And now it's time for your pop quiz. A bloat is a group of... Hippo. A crash is a group of... Rhino. Rhino. I really want to hear that tour guide on more things here at Disney. Like Haunted Mansion. This window has no windows and no doors. He was really, like, I'm, I'm so excited about that. The tour guide. He was fun. He was like, like, hey look, there's some rhino. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, the oh yeah like killed me. He's like, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. A lot of people forget that this is rock. The beastly kingdom, and it just sits there greeting us as we go to my favorite, favorite plant. But the real question is, should I? Yes, you should. I don't know what we're doing. Should I? I think we should. I think we should say hello. Good morning, my good friend. I've been waiting for this moment my entire life. Oh no. Let me help you. And then you gotta chant Red Rocket. Red Rocket. Red Rocket. Red Rocket. And, and did he approve? I, he approved like just moments after I stopped. It's kind of how it works nowadays. But one of the things to really keep in mind, I think hands down the theming of Pandora. Absolutely. Over here. Yeah, over here. Kills Toy Story Land. Like, the more you come over here and look at things, the more things you notice. Like this waterfall here, and here, and then the snails that look like they're falling over or something. I'm always surprised when I watch this show, because everybody would just kind of start like beating their hands on like certain drum elements. But hey, they come in, make some beautiful music. I keep making reference to that guy, but... He kind of looks like Junior Dos Santos, but I don't know. No, I totally know that guy. I, 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 I thought it was Junior Dos Santos, but at least one of the 
with the Nagara brothers, but I don't know. I don't know. So it is. Let me know in the comments. This is uh, disturbing. So they got the colossal pretzel, bottle of water. Where's that pineapple uh, egg roll thingy? Did they, did they get rid of it? I think it's gone. What? Yeah, the, the, they have that pineapple like. Oh yeah. Yeah, the pineapple egg roll. It's not on the menu. It's just the colossal pretzel. One thing I've yet to see in Pandora thus far, the guy in the robot suit. I don't know what they call those. I forget. But I haven't seen that guy at all. No matter how many times I've walked in this park. I know my guess is he's never seen him. Never seen the guy. But everybody's seen him. I want to see the guy in the robot suit. Do robots exist? Yeah, there's like, I, I wonder if it's because it's so like, empty or what but you can hear like sound coming from the mountains here like over in this area like it's a weird weird area to hear virtually everything around me I don't know what these animals are also Disney pro tip it says 135 minutes now I believe them but look right here now most people stop right there to take photos and because that area right here creates a traffic jam it can get more time added when was the last time you rode this ride micah pass order preview so did i i've never been able to ride this ride again until right now yeah this moment right now we're getting on navi river journey and for some reason like i can get on flight of passage in 30 minutes but this ride has been near impossible, so we're gonna go do Navi River Journey. Like these can hurt you. Yeah, I know firsthand. <laughs> Don't put your elbows down. These things are very dangerous. The most singular dangerous things in Disney property. Hey, okay, don't, don't, don't hit your elbow on these things. Okay. Don't hit your elbows on these things. Okay. Okay. Specifically your elbow. Oh my God. We don't know which way we're going. If you look, my pants are glowing. perfect but I still feel that ride is way too short for what it's trying to accomplish but because it's so hot it's like this bliss it immediately cools you down like in seconds and you're just like oh this is nice I can live here I can just live and then here. <laughs> and then the only problem is that it's like a third of small world the line for Scrooge McDuck but you know we got to give him some money some too. currency you know Scrooge McDuck much like Ted DiBiase, everybody got a price. That's right. Everybody's got a price. You say that Scrooge McDuck was going to check on his money? I don't think he has to worry about it. I got a single dollar bill. Hey, Scrooge McDuck, I presented you one single dollar. Oh, oh, see, I got to make sure, you know, Scrooge McDuck, you got to stay rich. You got to make sure you, above all, stay the richest of them all. Oh, that's so beautiful. That thing is beautiful. One day we'll go swimming in it. We'll do it, yeah? I'm gonna take it as an invite. But then again, you also have a book of how to disarm any foe. So, yeah, oh, 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 look at that. We just meet Launchpad McQuack. Launchpad, every landing is unforgettable. Like, like it, you land is 
something like that, right? That uh, I'm imagining like, like if we're flying, like yeah, something like that. It's it's. I did a little research. The actual voice actor who does Launchpad McQuack in the new version of DuckTales is Speck Bennett, who was in Saturday Night Live. I will say, I've never really looked up into this building and then seen like the diorama, but the thing that kind of catches everybody off guard is right back here where they turn this dinosaur into a vampire. Now, you know Disney is banking on the fact that nobody looks up because he added two Godzillas Attacking the city right up here <laughs> By the way, there's a third Godzilla and this is the real Godzilla He's here And everybody everybody including me walks right by him. Look at they got a Mickey Mouse marionette He's hanging I don't know which one is cooler the Mickey Mouse marionette or the Godzilla's. Oh, by the way uh, This is the most random artifact there's a McDonald's keychain right there. Curb your dino? Where's Larry David? So on the other side, if you look on the wall, they got old Turok, the dinosaur hunter, comic books. They have an X-Men right here. I'm more interested in this Turok. Like, oh yeah, I remember Turok. Remember like, famous monsters of film land? Yeah. And a lot of people know Turok from like the N64 game. Yeah. Which is fantastic, but the comic series is really good. So this is Fast Pass right now for Everest. Wow, 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 what? So it's been closed. I wonder if uh, they found the Yeti and put him back where he's supposed to go. But yeah, this is the line. Fast Pass, the Fast Pass line. Wow. It never is this long, ever. This is crazy. You stay over where you are, Cloud. We don't need you here. When you come and ride Dinosaur, there's actually one dinosaur song that comes to mind that you have to sing anytime that you see a dinosaur, like a Tyrannosaurus Rex. And I know you all are thinking of the same song that I'm thinking of. That song is Denver. The last dinosaur. <laughs> he was a dinosaur coming back through time. You know the nobody nobody knows that song. You don't know the lyrics. The last dinosaur. I guess just me. We're old. We're old people. Hi. Amazing vehicle. And then. Well, on to the tour that will be convince you wherever and is truly in the past. Notice, in the event of an emergency ride evacuation, follow the lights on the floor to the nearest exit. But, if we're back in time, where would the nearest exit be? If we're completely in, in the past. Where is the exit when we go to the past? I guess where we're going, there is no exits. Jesus Christ, that's Jason Bourne. This is a parallel time converter. They don't know the effect of what it'll do. You can tell everything's locked. Can't get in. But it's powering these things. We're going back in time. Here we go. We're going back in time. That's grim. Dinosaur run! Yeah, why is this scene in the ride like he's like, like an alligator? It's just eating yeah something. Yeah, it looks like, like an alligator. alligator and he's just chewing it down. And it's there for the world to see. Children watching a dinosaur <laughs> eat another dinosaur is literally the second thing you see on this ride. Most scariest ride in all the park, period. Debate me. Fight me in real life. Hey! I think we finally beat you. You evil, evil cloud monster guy thingy entity of weather. That's it. It's yeah. hot. It's, it's, we've had enough of the day. The day was full of missing yetis, dinosaurs, and random plants. Had a good time. I had a blast. We had a blast. It's, it's Animal Kingdom. You can't, you can't not come here and not have a good time. But once you have a good time, I think 
We're sick of it at this time. Are you sick of it, Micah? I'm sick of the heat. <laughs> sick of the heat. See the heat. It's too much. It's too much for us to take. We're melting. We're sweating. You see that glistening glow? See in my arms? Yeah, I see, see it. Micah arms? You see that? See that? Check on his elbow too, guys. That's that's the elbow he bumped Actually, earlier. It was this elbow. It's this elbow. Look at that. It's healing. It's healing. So, if you're watching the video, please make sure you hashtag pray for Micah. <laughs> <laughs> So that way he can heal faster. So that way he can make the best videos for all of us to enjoy. But that's it. We're done. We're sick of it. I'm out of this crowd. It's too many people. Okay, finally we made it. We made it. We're out. <laughs>